today I'm gonna be using the craziest glitches inside of the strongest battlegrounds, which includes a zero hitbox avatar, an emote that can one-shot anybody, a glitch that lets you spawn guns into the game, and a glitch that lets you use eight movesets at once. Let me know in the comments what your favorite glitch is that I do in this video, and watch until the end if you want W Riz just like me. Today in the strongest battlegrounds, I'm gonna be showcasing 10 of the most overpowered glitches in the game, and we're gonna be using them on toxic players that I found. So you guys are gonna want to watch the full video since the last glitch is insane. We're in a public server and I'm gonna try and find someone being toxic because I don't want to test out these glitches on normal players. That would be really mean. But every single time that I join a public server, there's someone being toxic. So I don't know. I think we're probably gonna be able to find someone. Bro, I was so mad because I thought the update released this morning. I got a ping like in the Yielding Arts Discord server and then I checked the ping and it was just some idiot pinging me in general chat whoever pinged me i am so angry at you but yeah um why is this guy walking up to me and attacking me bro i do not want to fight you oh my is this guy's actually gonna make me fight him all right bro you're you're making a mistake right now messing with the top g i hope you know that oh my i have three people attacking me at once i love this game so much this is my favorite game on roblox i cannot believe that i just died the person that killed me said easy 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 you suck mango pool lol i killed that garbage youtuber oh my gosh you killed me in roblox even though four people were attacking me no way you know what I i'm just gonna type gg in the chat i'm gonna be the bigger person i'm not gonna act toxic oh oh uh, she's walking up to me dude you're so trash you took one minute to kill one person and not even 200k subs bro we are gonna hit 200k subs soon everyone like and subscribe to prove her wrong we're gonna hit it by the end of this year mango i bet you're scared to rematch me you suck uh if anyone sucks in the game it's you you had to attack me with like five people in order to get one kill but i mean if you want to rematch i'll rematch you let me just ask her do you want to rematch yeah i'll take the w twice in a row okay i mean are, are you, you sure, sure about, about that, that? Yo, <laughs> bop oh my oh wow you're gonna you're just gonna block me okay yeah i've gotten much better with uh metal bat combos guys just watch oh my gosh wow yeah, like stop dude i swear some of these people are making me so mad okay yoink she sounds to half health let's just do beat down yes sir and then after that we are going to do a home run i just hit you with a baseball bat I'm gonna hit you three times and now i'm gonna do foul ball you're literally just getting destroyed i i don't understand how some of these people think that they can beat me in an actual 1v1 you're dead the animation whenever you finish them off is so funny like we just flung her across the map and you guys already know i am going to have to emote on her yes sir i really hope they add some more emotes to the next update because i'm getting kind of tired of reusing the same exact ones over and over and over again yo what are you guys the most excited for in the next update i am so excited for i think they're adding a boros move set or something like that but yeah i'm gonna try and get lily in the private server so that we could use some admin commands on her and also i'm gonna show you guys a bunch of different glitches as well oh lily is walking back up to me once again i wonder what she's gonna type this time you is a so paid to win what it's just because i'm using metal bat what there is no such thing as paying to win in this game because the exclusive move sets don't even have ultimate moves or anything i know you were hacking in that last round 1v1 me and your private server so you're not hacking how would that make a difference at all but i guess i'll add her to my private server some of these people are so dumb but i'm just gonna add her to my private server also guys i bought some robux codes the other day and i already have quite a bit of robux on my account so let me know do you guys think i should just start hiding them in my videos i feel like that would be pretty fun but yeah let me add lily to the private server hopefully she doesn't take an entire year to load in because it always happens every time i add people to private servers it takes them so long to load in i don't know why roblox's private server system sucks oh she loaded in finally okay it's time for us to show the first glitch actually i'll do a fair 1v1 with her and then show it because in the public server it's you know it, 1v1s in public servers are kind of annoying so we're gonna do a quick little rematch with her in the private server and then i'll show you guys the first glitch i just said yo lily are you ready to 1v1 and she said yes now hurry up or i'll bring in my dogs okay bro i am not scared of a dog unless it's a chihuahua or something those are very scary dogs i don't want to be bitten by a chihuahua dude these are the scariest most vicious dogs ever but yeah, let's just start the 1v1. 3, 2, 1, go. I'm 
using Sonic this time, which I'm not as good at. I think I'm a lot better with Metal Bat. Oh, I literally... See, I just missed with Whirlwind Kick, but it's all good because she's still down to half health already. Imagine being at half health. You know what? I'm not even gonna hit her for a second. I'm gonna let her get a few hits on me. So just let, we'll let her build up a bit of confidence. Okay, wait, wait, wait. I'm letting her get way too many hits on me. Okay, I need a... I need a stop! Yo, how far away can you hit people with, like, explosive shuriken? Yeah. <laughs> Oh my gosh, dude. This is so funny. Okay, she has B down to half health, but she's one shot and... Oh, no, no. She's two shots. Okay. Yo, wait! We killed her! Look at her avatar just in the ground right there. You know what? I'm, I'm gonna do the Club Penguin emote on you. <laughs> Yo, did any of you guys ever play Club Penguin? I used to play Club Penguin all the time, and then it got shut down! OMG, I knew you were cheating! I'm gonna post this on YouTube! Your brother Daiwei is so much better than you! Oh my- There is no way she just said that Daiwei is better than me. If you guys don't know, I have a younger brother named Daiwei, and there is no way that she thinks this guy is better at Roblox than me. This is literally the same guy that got his roblox girlfriend pregnant like what die wait how did this even happen the first glitch i'm gonna show you guys though you've probably seen it before if you watch all of my strongest battlegrounds videos i haven't used it much recently but i was literally using this in every single one of my videos at one point and i found a new and improved way to do this glitch so what you want to do is you want to equip the destructive cyborg moveset then once you got this moveset equipped you can only do this in private servers there's probably a way to do it in public servers though but you're gonna open up the private server commands you're gonna turn on no cooldown and then you're also gonna turn on no stun and then basically you're just gonna shift lock and you're gonna spam jet dive over and over again and bro you will go flying in the air this is like a super op fly glitch i've made so many people rage quit doing this it is so funny but yeah i'm pretty sure she's afk right now so once she gets back i'm gonna show her this glitch and we're gonna see her reaction if she rage quits i'm gonna laugh bro it is going to be so funny oh she just walked back up to me and said oh sorry i was afk yeah that's all good but i'm just gonna start fly hacking <laughs> what just happened i knew you were hacking my dad owns roblox he will ban you oh no i'm i'm so scared guys i'm gonna get banned from roblox no i'm gonna go back down there and then do another glitch so for this glitch to work you're gonna need an auto clicker and then you want to open up the admin panel right here and there's gonna be this command called spawn dummy and you pretty much just want to spawn in as many of these as you can before your computer starts lagging and exploding because if you spawn in a ton of these your computer is probably gonna explode as you can see i have a small little army right here and if i punch it i yeah it's probably gonna lag the server <laughs> and yeah lily is typing in the chat bro i can't move at all okay here's lily right here i'm just gonna kill lily real quick yoink i have not used menacing cyborg for a while uh i might not be that good at it but she can't move at all so it should be pretty easy you're literally like two more shots you are getting destroyed right now get out of my private server what are you doing messing with this hop pop bam pow and we just beat her in a 1v1 this next glitch reduces your hitbox by like 60 percent i made that number up but it reduces your hitbox by a lot what you want to do is you want to equip a bunch of these r throw items the ones that i have on right now cost quite a bit of robux but you can do this with literally any r throw package there's a ton of them that roblox made that are like completely free but i'm using the hero hunter moveset and i'm gonna walk up to her and she's not gonna be able to land nearly as many hits on me because my hitbox is so much smaller than normal but yeah let's just start hitting her yoink i'm using the hero hunter moveset now because i i don't know i'm not as good with some of these movesets so i want to try and make it a challenge for myself since i am using a bunch of glitches in these videos oh she stopped at half health and she just said stop i didn't say go i don't care if you didn't say go i'm the top g and i'm gonna do what i want we just hit you with this trash can bozo yes sir i i don't know why you're trying to fight me you have not beat me once other than earlier when you were teaming i literally just destroyed you she just said omg you suck mm -hmm, yeah this next glitch you're gonna need hero hunter for as well and you're gonna open up the admin panel and then turn on instant ultimate infinite ultimate no cooldown and no sun then what you want to do is you want to press this give ultimate thing and then just spam g over and over and over again your avatar should just start glowing and do this one animation like this once you've done this about like 30 40 50 times you're just gonna release it it's gonna lag the entire server and give you like 30 ultimate moves 
Bro, the whole server is frozen right now. <laughs> like, this is one of the most overpowered things in the game. Look at this weird aura that's, like, around my avatar. <laughs> Make sure you guys have all your notifications on because I'm gonna be releasing a part two with the rest of the glitches in them. And, yeah, bye. Today in the Strongest Battlegrounds, I'm gonna be testing a bunch of different secrets slash glitches to see if they are real or fake. Some of these include a secret weapon that can bypass death counter, a portal hidden somewhere on the map, a glitch that lets you go flying into the air. We got a bunch of different stuff that you guys don't want to miss. And also, I'm going to be letting you guys play along with me. Every time I test out a new secret, you guys need to guess if it's real or fake. And if you guess correctly, give yourself 10 points and then comment at the end of the video how many points you have. But yeah, with that being said, let's go. So this first secret is one that I know works and it's basically like a fly hack, which you can also use to go to a secret spot on the map. What you want to do is you want to equip the Sonic moveset, aka Deadly Dinsha. They changed the name of this like two or three times for some reason. I don't know why. And then you want to go to settings right here and enable no cooldown. Then you're going to shift lock and start walking backwards and then just spam the letter four, which is explosive shuriken. And bro, you will go flying across the air. Look at me right now. I've used this admin command to troll so many people and not a whole lot of people know about it. Like, I think I'm the only person that's ever done this in a video. But once you've flied for long enough, you can jump down and land on top of here. And then you pretty much just have an entire view of the map. It's been rumored that they might patch this glitch soon, but I really hope they don't patch it. That's 10 points for me though, so let's move on to the next secret. Now, this next myth slash secret is that apparently if you have a completely new account with zero kills, you'll be put into a server with a bunch of people that also have zero kills. Apparently, it's the same way around. Like, if you have 1,000 kills, you'll be put in a server with a bunch of people who also have 1,000 kills. It's basically like skill-based matchmaking, I think. So I'm gonna make a brand new account to test this out. Gonna put my birthday as April 1st, 1969. This is definitely my real birthday. The username is gonna be Mango Pool is the best one too. And the password. I'm gonna have the password for this account hidden somewhere in the video. Please don't do anything bad on this account if you guys find the password. But yeah, let's load into the strongest battlegrounds and see if we actually get put in a server with a bunch of noobs. I'm not too sure about this one. We just loaded in and let's check the leaderboard. Bro, there is somebody with nearly 7,000 kills in my game. Okay, yeah, this is definitely false, which means I lost 10 points and I'm now down to zero points. I can't believe I just lost 10 points. This is worse than when my Roblox girlfriend left me. Let's just move on to the next myth. So this next secret slash glitch is that apparently trash cans are able to bypass death counter. If this is true, it would literally make trash cans the most OP weapon in the game. Not even sorcerer can bypass death counter, which means if trash cans can bypass it, they are the new most overpowered thing in the game. So I'm gonna turn on infinite ultimate in my VIP server and then on my alt account I'm gonna punch myself over and over again until I unlock ultimate and I can get death counter. There's probably a faster way to do this but I'm too lazy so I'm just gonna keep punching myself. Yoink bop bam pow. Bro one kill isn't enough for ultimate. I guess it's time for round two. Yes sir. Okay we finally got ultimate. Now I'm back on my main account and I'm gonna pick up a trash can real quick and then I'm gonna go back on my alt, activate ultimate, and do death counter. Okay, now really quickly, I need to throw the trash can at myself. No, it doesn't work! Bro, that would have actually been so funny if trash cans were the most OP weapon in the game. This was like a really big rumor, so I guess they must have patched it in the last update. Mm. Anyways, I'm now at minus 10 points. I have no idea how this even happened, but I mean, maybe the next myth will be true. We'll see. This next glitch apparently gives you multiple ultimate moves at once. I heard you can get like up to 13 of them. I don't even know what that would look like because at the bottom of the screen, there's four. Like, is there even enough room on the screen for 13 of them? But from what I've heard, this also can freeze the game in the process and lag it a ton. So hopefully I do not explode my computer in the process. Let's pray nothing happens. What you need to do is you need to open the VIP server settings and turn on infinite ultimate, no cooldown, and no sun. Here it is. I've messed this up like three or four times in the past, so hopefully I did it correctly. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna spam give ultimate and G over and over again. Your avatar should do some weird animation like this, but after you've done it enough times, it apparently like does this. 
Wait, yo, that actually looks so cool. And my game is frozen. <laughs> yeah, I have no idea what just happened to the game. Everything is really delayed when I try to move or turn my camera. I also have this weird aura around my avatar. But yeah, as you can see, we successfully unlocked 13 ultimate moves. If I do the math correctly, we're back up to zero points. Let me know in the comments if you guys are doing better than me. I need to restart this server so that I stop lagging. And I'll see you guys for the next bit. This next bit is that if you like the video and then subscribe and turn on notifications you will become a professional player at this game not gonna lie this is probably true because you'll get notifications for all of my videos where i teach you how to become the best pro player yes sir but anyways let's move on to the next secret i think i'm at like 20 points now this next glitch i have no idea how to explain it so i'm gonna let zebra explain it because i could not memorize how to do this there are so many steps it's way too complicated and my brain is too small to memorize all of it but basically this glitch guarantees that you will win every ranked round and he made this three weeks ago so it's pretty recent hopefully this still works let's see now to do this you're gonna need a friend so i'm here with my friend noob to show okay i'm already not gonna be able to test this out because i don't have any friends so we'll, we'll just let him show how to do this so when you load into a duels game you're gonna have your teammate punch you and then you need to hit them with hunter's grass okay i'm guessing this is gonna let them bypass some system that's in place For some reason this makes it so that you can stand on each other's heads I knew it! I'm so smart! So I prefer to be using Hero Hunter and have my teammate use Bald Hero to make this easier. But yeah, once you are able to stand on each other's heads, you can then do a glitch inside of Roblox called Frog Hopping to get on top of the clipping on the side of the map. Wait, I used to do this in another game. I forgot what the game was called, but I remember doing this like five years ago and trolling people. Go into more depth on how to frog hop in just a minute. All right, and as you can see, we just fell on top of the clipping around the sides of the map. Now Wait, okay, if this works, then that's actually really OP. For those of you who don't know, I literally only have one ranked win. I need to step up my game, so let's see if this works. Okay, after doing some research, guys, I have some bad news. Shortly after Seabra's video released, the developer added an invisible ceiling to the ranked map because I guess a lot of people were just abusing this like it is a pretty OP glitch but luckily I know a similar glitch that you guys can do in public servers just like this normal lobby right here and this hasn't been patched at all it still works basically if you go up to this wall right here and then do the exact same thing in a normal public server then you can pretty much do the exact same thing and get up here you will be invincible nobody is gonna be able to kill you so I guess I'll give myself like half a point for that one i don't know but yeah let's move on to the next glitch or secret this next secret is that apparently there's a move set which can't be killed by sorcerer i'm a little bit skeptical of this but apparently in the last update there's a rumor that they made it to where metal bat can't be killed by sorcerer now i don't know how true this is because i don't know how stupid the developers are they seem like pretty smart people so i don't know we'll test this out real quick i'm back on my alt account and we need to join the vip server i also had to spend three 300 robux to get metal bat i am going broke making this video but we just loaded in so let me switch to metal bat real quick they just added two new moves to metal bat so i'm kind of excited to use these but now i need to go back on my main account and then switch to sorcerer we gotta press one to activate all the moves and yoink oh okay yeah this one is false but i was really skeptical of this i just lost 10 more points i don't even know how many i have right now but if i'm not mistaken there is another trick you can do to bypass the sorcerer moves so let me go back on my alt account real quick and we're gonna switch to bald hero now i just need to unlock ultimate really quickly bro this is gonna take me like another 20 minutes <laughs> yoink bop bam pow wait i'm on the wrong account okay we finally unlocked ultimate now i can go on my main account and switch back to sorcerer and now if i activate ultimate i should be able to use death counter on sorcerer so let me just do the red move and wait what bro i could have sworn that um death counter couldn't get killed by sorcerer what okay i just lost another 10 points hopefully this next glitch actually works so this next secret is that apparently there is an entire map that looks just like this but it's like underneath the ground now i should be able to successfully reach it if i use the glitch we did earlier so i just switched to sonic and enabled no cooldown as well and i should be able to just fly all the way to the top of the map and then jump down there so we're up here and then suppose Supposedly underneath this is like another map. Let's see. Before I've even started to go down, there's like this weird thing down here that keeps beeping. So I think we're gonna try to see that as well. But I should be able to just fly on all the way down here. And wait, yeah, there is like a small little 
little base plate down here. Okay, I'm gonna try my best to fly over to it, and then I also want to check out what that thing right there is. Bro, I had no idea there was, like, a whole nother map right here. Okay, let's see. Can we land on it? Bro, we just fall through it? Bro, it would have been so cool to, like, actually just do a 1v1 down there with someone. But if you guys know any more secrets, let me know in the comments. And if this video gets 1,000 likes, I'll do a part two. Today in the strongest battlegrounds, I'm going to be cheating using invisibility. We're gonna see how many toxic players we can make rage quit, but first I need to find someone that's being toxic, so let's hop into a public server. All right, here we are in the public server. Let's see. I need to find someone that's like actually being toxic and being mean because I don't want to troll just a normal player. Bro, why is nobody in the server being toxic? Everyone in the chat is just being normal. This is a very rare occurrence. Usually it is the complete opposite. I've never seen a server like this in the four months that i've been playing this game oh hold up someone types in the chat anyone want a team i thought there were gonna be any toxic players but now there are teamers in here let me know in the comments do you guys think teamers or toxic players are worse let me try to find where this bozo is at okay we gotta look for someone with some weird ass haircut like what even are they wearing uh is this them right here yeah their name's veronica okay genuinely what are you wearing is this supposed to look good okay i'm gonna act like i want to team with them i said yo let's team all right, bet we're gonna kill this entire server of noob. Yeah, the only person getting killed is you. Yo, <laughs> you really thought you were gonna come into the server and team? Not today, no, sir. You made a mistake trying to team with the top G because now I'm gonna destroy you. Let me just uppercut you into the sky. You're already below half health. What are you doing? Your entire career is going to be over in like 0.5 seconds. Yo, you are dead. And you already know we have to emote on them. Let's do the rip emote bro the rip emote is so funny uh someone's just asking the chat if i'm real uh guys i'm the fake bango pool i'm the fake one yeah you said we were gonna team why you kill me because teaming in public servers is dumb if you want to team then like go in the dual servers they have an entire 2v2 game mode i don't think the whole public lobby is gonna be one of doing 2v1s i need to get veronica in my private server though so that we can do a 1v1 where i use the invisibility glitch to troll them so i'm just gonna ask wanna rematch in my private server and let's see what veronica says oh veronica said yes right now okay let me add them to the private server boys all right we just got veronica added to the private server let's load it and wait for them one eternity later bro it took so long but finally veronica loaded into the server i'm gonna show you guys how to do the invisible thing here in a second but first i want to do a normal would be one we just asking the chat uh veronica you there okay and veronica said Said yes okay let's see are you ready to rematch we're gonna do a normal round before we pull out any invisible avatars veronica said obviously all right but yeah you just went flying across the map oh oh you're, you're gonna hit me with uh with that move okay wow you're gonna you're gonna be a sonic spammer you're gonna be a little sonic spammer okay yeah you're already down to half health i don't know what you're doing or why you think you can actually beat me boink oh oh no no it's all good guys it's all good she's like three shots i don't know why my attacks are being so delayed oh my gosh you were one shot there you go i'm just gonna have to take the l on you wait guys we have ultimate okay i'm gonna activate this in a second oh veronica is walking up to me okay uh veronica what do you want that one you one was unfair how was it unfair what i'm i'm confused because my cat sat on my lap okay i don't understand what i was gonna switch to another move set but i think i'm just gonna activate ultimate and kill veronica right here let me do all the directional punch bro they haven't added any new cool ultimate moves like this in a little bit but you're getting destroyed veronica dude i love that move so much okay i was about to pull out the invisible avatar but i think i have a funnier idea they were spamming sonic last round so i'm gonna equip sonic and we're gonna get some revenge and spam sonic back so i'm gonna open up the admin panel real quick and we're gonna turn on the no cooldown admin command we will literally be able to just spam sonic over and over again speaking of spamming moves if you want to make it even even worse you would have turned on no sun so have on no cooldown and no sun at the same time no one's gonna be able to kill you you are going to be spamming moves for days so um veronica are you ready to rematch veronica said yeah all right bet well um i'm gonna give you a taste of your own medicine bob bam boink bob pow bro explosive shuriken is so fun to spam too with this oh my gosh dude i just hit them like three times in a row and flung them across the map you're already at half health what are you doing how are you this bad at the game Let's do scatter as well. Okay, you're literally one shot. There you go. You're dead. No sun makes the game look so 
chirpy, so I am gonna go ahead and turn that off. There's four different ways you could do this invisible thing, but I just want to give them one last fair rematch before we pull them out. I feel kind of bad because I use the ultimate moves and then I use no cooldown. So we're gonna do one last fair rematch. We'll see if they could beat me. I just walked up to Veronica and I'm gonna say three, two, one, go and pop. Veronica, like what's going on? You should be able to win against me easy right here. I maybe, maybe Veronica's internet is just bad. Stop, I'm lagging. I don't really care if you're lagging, honestly. Why would I let you lagging stop me from taking a W? Okay, I'm lagging too now, but uh, we just won that fight. Easiest stop I've ever taken. And you already know we have to hit the gritty on them. Oh, Veronica's walking up to me again. Okay, let's see. What is Veronica going to say this time? As a proud woman, I do not tolerate this kind of behavior. You should be banned off from Roblox. Guys, I think I should be banned from Roblox, guys. Cancel Mango Pool. I just typed in the chat that I agree. I should be banned from Roblox. You don't even have 200k subs. You're so trash, idiot. Okay, everyone like and subscribe right now to prove this bozo wrong. We're gonna hit it eventually, all right, guys? But the first thing you wanna do for the invisible glitch is you wanna switch to either Hero Hunter or Bald Hero because you don't want a moveset that's gonna have these extra items like the Katana. Destructive Cyborg is even worse. If you use Destructive Cyborg, you're just an idiot, okay? I'm just gonna put it simply. And then you wanna equip this certain item. The freaking Avatar page is broken right now. I'm gonna try joining this game and see if it'll work because I really need to equip this item. <laughs> oh, okay. I can save this as my Roblox avatar. Okay, let's go. Oh my gosh. I'm a genius. I am so smart. Okay, this is just the first way to go invisible. There's three other ways, guys. But let me load back into the private server. Hopefully... Okay, she didn't leave the server. Perfect. Bro, come on. Get my avatar loaded properly. I'm gonna have to reset like one million times. There we go. There we go. So now, once you have this avatar, you want to go under a tree. And then, bro, if you zoom out... No! No one's gonna be able to see you, bro. You are pretty much invisible. Like, if there's someone far away across the map, they are not gonna see you. They're probably just gonna walk by you. Matter of fact, let's wait for Veronica to walk by us, and then we're gonna use this move right here, Flowing Water. It's basically aimbot. I don't know why they added this. It's kind of annoying in public servers, to be honest. Let's just wait for Veronica to walk by us. Oh, oh, Veronica's walking up to us. All right. Yoink. <laughs> Dude, this is so fun to troll people with. Oh. Oh my gosh, dude. Veronica, you are going down. Yeah! <laughs> we just countered Veronica. And yeah, I'm just gonna throw this trash can at you. Uh, you're dead. There's another outfit though that's like 10 times better than this. So I'm gonna go ahead and equip that. The avatar page is still- I guess we got a rejoin catalog avatar creator once again. Thank God this game exists. Let me just load my freaking outfits once again. We're gonna wear this outfit right here. If you guys wanna get this outfit, by the way, you can just uh load in my outfits type in my username right here adam mango pool on the outfit loader in this game and you'll be able to get all of my outfits i think this cost me like 30 robux or something i don't know something like that but let me load back into the game now and show you guys why this disguise is much more op basically if you walk up to one of these walls right here and then just go like in the shadow people are not going to be able to see you but if you want to make this even better you can just hide in a corner and bro you're basically invisible i don't think a single person is gonna notice this matter of fact let's wait for veronica to walk by again bro veronica keeps typing in the chat where are you so i just said um i don't know bro i was here for like five minutes before she even typed that she said tell me where you are right now or else we're gonna have problems um just come find me uh okay oh wait there's veronica right there all right um it took quite a while for veronica to find me but you ain't <laughs> Hold up, I'm gonna turn on kick on death, so whenever Veronica dies, there's gonna be, like, a bad message that pops up on her screen. Have health, okay? Yeah, you are super low. You are so low. There you go. You are... You're dead. Let's go. Easy. So, I found an emote that can one-shot anybody, and that is the cart ride emote right here, but you need two people for this. So, I got my buddy Demon right here. What's up, Demon? Yeah, what's good? Yo, Demon, you just got kidnapped by shopping cart, you little idiot. I'm about 
about to kill you with this. Mango, please don't kill me, man. Now, in order to do this, you need two people. And what you're gonna do is the person with the shopping cart is gonna kidnap the victim, and your teammate is gonna hide behind a tree with their ultimate, and then you are gonna bring the victim over here. You're gonna jump out, and then your teammate is going to pop their ultimate on the victim and immediately kill them. So me and Demon are gonna hop in some public servers, and we're gonna try this out. Are you ready, Demon? I'm born ready. Let's go! Okay, we loaded into the first public server. I'm letting Demon farm his ultimate. Now, you want to do these in relatively small servers, because if you load into, like, a massive huge server, it's gonna be really hard whenever everyone's killing each other. And yo, hold up! Is that a fake mango pool? Demon, are you seeing this on the leaderboard, bro? There's, like, a fake mango in here. Wait, that's a fake mango? I thought that was you. What? No, like, you just killed me, but right now, you're farming ultimate on a fake mango. That, that mango over there is not actually me. Bro, what? Okay, bro, 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 bro. We gotta troll this guy. We gotta troll this guy. He's saying the other mango is trash. Bro, what? Oh, also, guys, we're gonna be doing this with every single moveset, and the first one we're doing is Sonic, but, bro, I can't wait to do this with, like, Atomic Samurai or with Genos. Bro, he's saying help. He's running away. Bro, you can tell he's fake because he doesn't have my new cape right here, bro. I got a new cape, and he's still wearing the old one. Boom! Easy. Okay, demon, do you have your ultimate yet? Let me know when you have it. Yes, sir. Can you see me? Okay, okay. I'm gonna try to get this fake mango pool in my shopping cart. Hold up, he's walking around. He just said, "Yo, I am the real mango pool," and he did not even spell my name correctly. Yeah, that is totally something that I would say in a server to someone. Bro, his username is real mango pool YouTube, and all of his messages are just getting hashtagged. I can gift you some bobux, kids. What, bro? I don't I don't think he realizes we're like the real ones. And bro, if I pull up his profile, <laughs> his bio says the real mango pool from YouTube with over 400,000 subscribers. Be sure to unsubscribe from my channel, dislike my videos, and gift me game passes. What is it? What is this guy's profile? Isn't this the guy who I trolled in one of my other videos? Why would I tell people to unsubscribe and dislike my videos? We will never reach 500k. Guys, like and subscribe to prove this guy wrong. Okay, you know what? This is the perfect guy to troll with this shopping cart. Thing. Demon, what do you think about what's going on right now? Honestly, man, I'm just enjoying some ramen right now. Okay, I don't know what you're doing, but Demon, are you ready to troll this guy with ultimate? Bro, I am so ready. He said he spit on my ramen. What? Demon, I got a banger idea. So, you know how this guy clearly wants some game passes and stuff? I'm gonna tell him, if you get in my shopping cart, I'll give you a game pass. And he just said, yo! Bro, he's freaking out. Bro, really wants these game passes. He just said, for real? Yes, sir, for real. And Demon, are you hiding behind a tree, bro? Dude, I'm just watching and waiting. Bro is just sitting watching like Sneeko. Okay, he said, you know I want my goddess Tatsumaki. Okay, this guy really thinks he's me. Bro is simping for Tatsumaki, but the difference between him and me is that I can actually pull Tatsumaki. You know what I'm saying, Demon? No, no, you can't. Don't bro, lie yes, to I can. Show. Okay, let me just get him in my shopping cart. He just said, I mean, Gyatsumaki. Okay, bro. I'm just gonna drive him around in my shopping cart. And Demon, I'll tell you when to pop your ultimate on him. Oh, uh, which move are you gonna do, Demon? I have no clue. I might just spam him. Okay, bet. I'm just gonna keep driving him around. And, bro, we're gonna do this later with Saitama. We're gonna do omnidirectional punch. And, bro, he's just saying we in the chat. Why did the chat bubbles pop up above my head? I don't know why the game is like that, but, Demon, I'm driving him over to you, bro. Pop your ultimate now. Pop it now. All right, let's do this. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, now, now, pop ultimate on it. Pop ultimate. Hold on. I'm dashing away. That's him right there. Bruh. Bruh. He said, oh, stop. Bro, I can't even hit him. He has trash Wi-Fi. What is going on? I can't even hit. Bro, he's floating. All right, you know what, buddy? Just just get down. It's time to die. You're dead. Yeah, I'm going to have to hit you with crushing pool, buddy. You're dead. Okay, I'm not going to lie, bro. I think we need to do this with a better moveset. Like, this would be so much better if we did omnidirectional punch on them the second we drive the shopping cart over. Oh, what if we did destructive cyborg? Oh, destructive cyborg would be perfect. Okay, okay. Demon, switch to that, bro. That wasn't nice, guys. Yeah, I don't really care, buddy. Demon, just farm ultimate really quickly. Keep beating him up. Okay, I have a perfect idea. Since this guy's really stupid, we're just gonna both keep beating him up over and over again, and then we're gonna tell him that we're sorry. We're not gonna do it again, and then we're gonna troll him with the shopping cart right after that. Oh my god, I already almost have my ult in the way. He said you guys are being meanies. Yeah, I don't really care, buddy. You know what, Demon? Jump him, bro. I'll pull him over to you. Beat him up. Yes, sir. We just gotta get ultimate, and bro, are you gonna do incinerate on him or something? Incinerate would be so funny. He's raging in the chat, bro. It's like, no! Dude, I might just have to. This kid is cringe. He's saying Wi-Fi. Dude, what is this 
Wi-Fi. This Wi-Fi is so bad. I don't think I've ever seen Wi-Fi this trash before. I hit bro with the finisher. I have my maximum energy output waiting on standby. Okay, bet. I'm gonna walk over to him. He's growling on us in the chat. He's saying, you guys make me angry. I have over 400k subs. Bro is still pretending to be the real Lego pool. And this is how you treat me. Yes, sir, it is. You know what, bro? I'm sorry. I apologize. Just get in my shopping cart again, and I'll give you the game pass. And he just said, oh, it's okay. I forgive you then. Bro, this fake mango is so desperate for game passes. Okay, buddy, just get in my shopping cart, bro. Just get in my shopping cart. Okay, demon, I see you behind the tree. I'm gonna drive him around for a little bit, and he's gonna think that we're not doing anything, bro. He's gonna think that I'm just driving around, chilling in the game, and then I'm gonna drive him over to demon, and we're gonna pop and incinerate on him. He's like, yay, this is so fun. And wait, demon, you already popped your ultimate, bro. You're supposed to wait. He just said, I can't wait to get early access. Oh my gosh, demon, I can't believe you popped your ultimate already. Okay, I'm just gonna bring him over, and demon, demon, do it. Uh, pop incinerate on him, bro. I'm just gonna dash yes! away. Yes! <laughs> What's he saying in the chat? He just said, oh, he's like, you lied to me. Yeah, bro, is raging in the chat. And bro, demon, just beat him up, bro. Jump his ass. Bro, this is too easy. Oh my god, free kills. And with a little bit of that, boom, boom. One, two, three. Down slam. I'm just gonna hit him with crushing pull, and I'm gonna steal your kill, demon. Elbozo. Wait, you just steal my kill? Yes, sir, I did. Okay. Oh, okay. Bro is beating me up now. Demon, you know who would be really funny to troll with this, bro? Daiwei. Daiwei would rage so hard. I know. Okay, let's get Daiwei in a private server, and we're gonna troll him with this, bro. He would be so bad. We didn't do, like, all the directional punch, metal bat, and, like, those movesets on him, because it would be so funny. The fake mango is saying, I hate you guys so much. I'm leaving. All right, bro. Go leave the game and cry to your imaginary girlfriend, you little bozo. Bro, demon, technically, we made the entire server rage quit, because we joined a public server, and it was just that guy. Okay, demon, I just sent Daiwei the invite, and he loaded in. Bro, Daiwei's been grinding. He has 100 kills. Bro, 100 kills. I have 10,000 kills. That's nothing. Okay, bro, you don't like this game and talk to e-girls in Roblox voice chat, bro. That's different. You only have 10k kills, so you can talk to e-girls. Hey, Mango, remember when you had me look for e-girls for you? Okay, that never happened, bro, but Daiwei's right here. <laughs> and Daiwei just said, why do you want me here? I'm trying to talk to my e-girls. <laughs> yeah, of course you are, Daiwei. Oh, he does not get e-girls, bro. Let's be real. Come on, don't lie to yourself, buddy. Yeah, it's probably a bunch of 50-year-old men on the account. Bro is just typing angry faces in the chat. Okay, Daiwei, I'm gonna tell him I have a glitch to show him. I told him he smells like moldy cheese. Daiwei definitely smells like moldy cheese, and he just said, oh, question mark? Yeah, we got a glitch, bro. <laughs> and he's raging at what you just said. He's like, no, I, I don't smell like moldy cheese. Yes, you do. Okay, Demon, do you have your ultimate yet? Bro, I've been ready. I'm ready to get pumped up. Okay, I'm just gonna do the shopping cart, and I'm gonna say, Get in, I have a glitch. Bro, I just felt glitched so bad, but get in, Daiwei. Come on, buddy, get in the shopping cart. I'm gonna drive him around for a little bit so he thinks that nothing is up. And then, Demon, are you hiding behind the tree, bro? I'm hiding and watching, stalking my prey. Okay, I, I don't know what you're doing right now, Demon. I can't even find the tree that you're behind. Daiwei just said, where's the glitch? Yeah. Bro, you gotta be patient, Daiwei. You gotta be patient. We're about to do the glitch in a second, buddy. Okay, I'm just gonna try and find the tree where you're at. I have no idea where you are. Did you pop your ultimate yet? Look, I'm dancing over here. Oh, I see you, I see over you, I see you. Here. Okay, okay. Demon, go behind the tree and pop your ultimate now. Pop, pop, pop. Okay, once I bring him over, I need you to do strength difference on him, bro. It's gonna be so funny. Okay, I don't think Daiwei sees you. Let me just bring the shopping cart over, speed it up. Okay, okay, strength difference, strength difference. Pop, yes, sir. Pop. Adios. Bro, Daiwei is trash, bro. That was too funny, bro. That was so funny. Oh, he's still alive? Nah, bro. Nah, bro. Daiwei thinks he can still live, bro. He thinks he's still standing. What's he saying in the chat? He just said, what the heck? Oh, look, he's angry. He's angry. I said, where's the glitch? It's right here, buddy. You death load him. Yeah. Bro, Daiwei is garbage. Okay, you know what would make Daiwei even more bad? If we did all the directional punch on him. Oh, say less. Okay, hold up. I'm gonna walk up to Daiwei and I'm just gonna say, sorry, Daiwei. I apologize for trolling you. It won't happen again. <laughs> okay, Demon, Demon, just farm your ultimate on me. Like, kill me over and over again. Try and hit the weakest of me too. Because if you can hit two people at once, you'll farm your ultimate way quicker. I tested it out earlier. Say less. Let me go. One, two, three. Boom. Oh and my bro, god, I have the 
perfect way to get Daiwei in the shopping cart again. I'm gonna tell him that he'll get free e-girls if he hops in. You already know Daiwei's gonna be getting in that shopping cart immediately. All right, look at that. Serious mode is ready. You got it? Okay, okay, okay. Watch this, watch this, watch this. I'm gonna walk up to Daiwei and I'm just gonna say, yo, Daiwei, yo, yo, Daiwei. And he said, question mark, there's free e-girls if you get in this shopping cart and the demon go hide behind a tree. Are you mewing on him? Yeah, I was a little busy mewing. Don't worry, don't worry. Daiwei just said for real? Yes, sir, bro. There are so many e-girls if you get in this shopping cart. And bro, just hit me. Bro, get in the shopping cart, Daiwei. Quickly go ahead. Pop this. Yes, sir. Okay, okay. I'm driving it right over to you. Bro, where are you at? I cannot even find you. Oh, I see you. I see you. Over I see here. You. Okay, okay. I'm just gonna drive around for a bit. And demon, whenever I tell you to, I need you to all be directional punch. He just said, where are they at? I'm driving you to them, bro. I'm driving you to all the e-girls, buddy. Okay, demon, I see you over there bro it's gonna be so funny whenever i bring him over hold up hold up hold up okay i'm bringing him over i'll, I'll tell you when i'll tell you when don't do it yet okay okay i jumped out okay omnidirectional punch bro omnidirectional punch Whoa! Bro! <laughs> all right just gotta go ahead and bounce around here hey yo die way i got a delivery for you buddy adios bro that was so funny dude oh my gosh bro we got die way so good you said you're not an e-girl yeah no e-girls for you today buddy you're garbage, Daiwei. And Demon, you know the final moves that we gotta do, bro? We gotta do Atomic Samurai, bro. It's gonna be so funny. And bro, I think the next person we should troll is Anna, bro. Because she knows nothing about the game. She's kind of trash. Don't you think it would be funny to troll her, Demon? I don't know, man. That might make her a little mad at you. I don't know, bro. I think she's already pretty bad at me. So it, it will hurt making her a little bit more mad. Have you been mewing instead of spending time with her? I've been talking to Tatsumaki instead of spending time with her, bro. I'm not even gonna cap. Hey, no. Way. Okay, demon, I got Anna in the server, and bro, she's really bad because I've been looking at pictures of Tatsumaki recently instead of talking to her. So basically, I told her that I brought her to the server to apologize and that I have a surprise for her and stuff. And the surprise is gonna be you popping your atomic samurai ultimate on her. So sounds like a bro, you're dirty for that. You're dirty for that. Honestly, bro, I don't really care. But yeah, are you ready, demon? Yeah, I have my scorching blade on standby. Okay, I just said Anna, I apologize for not being loyal recently. I should not have looked up pictures of Tatsubaki at 2 a.m. instead of calling you. Do you accept my apology? Demon, you just have a trash can. Why are you throwing trash cans at her, bro? You need to calm down, bro. Chill. And she said, yeah, dot, dot, dot. I accept your apology. Okay, well, you're about to unaccept my apology after what I'm about to do. Just don't do it again. Uh, okay, yeah. I, I won't do it again. Okay, Demon, Demon, go hide behind a tree, bro. Go hide behind a tree. I just said to the chat, I have a surprise for you. Get in the shopping cart. Okay, okay. I, I think she, she's about to get it. Bro, she just punched me. Bro, I hate how, like, you accidentally punch people sometimes instead of getting in the shopping cart. Like, they need to make that button easier to press. Okay, come on. Bro, dude, Anna sucks at getting inside a shopping cart. So I, don't, I don't think she has any idea on how to play this game. Come on, just get in the shopping cart. Okay, I'm gonna drive her around the map for a little bit, and then I'm gonna bring her over to you, and you need to pop the Atomic Samurai Ultimate on her. And, bro, Anna just fell out of the shopping cart. Now, get back in. And she's like, I'm so excited. I can't wait for this surprise. What is it? Okay. If you guys have a girlfriend, don't do this. Uh, I'm just doing this for educational purposes. Uh, I'm gonna drive her over to X Demon. <laughs> guys, don't worry. After this, I will take her on like a very romantic date and apologize for hitting her with ultimate and googling pictures of Tatsubaki. Okay, Demon, pop your ultimate and then do whatever move and one shots her, bro. Do like a atomic slash on her, bro. That'll be so funny. Grab her there. I ain't done yet, sweetheart. Boom. <laughs> Oh so my god, this is so action. bad, bro. This is actually so bad stuff. Oh, look at that. She's already dead. Get it, dong, dong. Today, I'm going to show you guys the most overpowered avatars that you could use in the strongest battlegrounds. One of these avatars, like, literally completely removes hitboxes. So, you guys will want to stick around for that. But first, I want to find a toxic player to troll with these avatars. So, let's hop into a public server. All right, boys, we are in a public server now. And, of course, I am immediately getting hit by ultimate. Uh, nothing new. But yeah, I'm gonna try and find someone who's acting like kind of toxic. I honestly cannot wait to test out these avatars though. I have one avatar that's like really huge and takes up a large portion of the map. I have one avatar that completely removes hitboxes. Like it's crazy. And also we're gonna be gifting out some game passes later in the video. Why is there some bacon hair following me around? Bro, do you wanna fight? Okay, never mind. He is running away from me. And I just noticed this guy in the chat saying, stupid idiot, I'm better than you. Ha ha ha. I am best player. What is bro? 
we been typing about? His username is McDonald Cheeseburger. What? Some people just need to realize the world would be a better place if they didn't have inputs on things. He just typed, wow, Mango Pool and Big Fan. Wait, this guy's a fan of me and he's being toxic? What? JK, you have no fans? I bet that was the first time a fan ever said hi to you, lol. Okay, I'm 1v1ing this guy. Why is he being so toxic? Okay, I think I see him. I'm pretty sure that is McDonald Cheeseburger over there. Bro is just running around. No, 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 no. We are gonna 1v1 him and then we're gonna get him in the private server and we're gonna troll him with all of the avatars. I have so many overpowered avatars that I'm gonna show you guys in this video. Bro, this guy is trying to fight me. You are not going to beat me in a fight. Yoink! Yeah, I just hit you with flash strike and oh, you wanna run away from the top G? He's down to half health and this dude is literally screaming in the chat. I'm using Sonic, which they just nerfed the other day. Bro is begging me to stop. He is begging for mercy in the chat. Yes, sir! Oh, you thought you could counter me right there? You thought you could counter me? No, not today. You were one shot. Oh, no! He hit me. It's all good though because I just did scatter and we ended that bozo's career. And you guys already know we are going to hit the gritty on him. But yeah, I'm gonna get this guy in my private server so we can test out some of the OP avatars on him. He just tried to throw a trash can at me and missed. I just asked him though if he wanted to join my VIP server so we could rematch. And he said no because you probably troll. All people like you do that. Oh my gosh. I need to get this guy in my private server. Okay, I have an idea. I'm gonna bribe him. Him with a game pass i just said what if i give you a game pass you have to give pass first oh my okay i'll give him a game pass bro the second that i mentioned gifting game passes now there's like some random guy who walked up and he's probably also gonna ask for a game pass i'm just gonna gift this guy the cheapest game pass possible and if you guys also want a game pass i'm gonna be gifting out some game passes to people who call it the secret word which i will reveal later in the video i just gifted him a game pass and now this guy named gojo is like please game pass oh and mcdonald's cheeseburger just said wow this game pass sucks Fine, whatever. I gifted this guy a game pass and he didn't even say thank you. Wow, this guy is so ungrateful. Let me go ahead and add him to my private server though. Let's just join the private server and wait for him. And bro, this guy immediately loaded into the private server. He just said in the chat, I want that rematch, you're going down. I'm only here because you gifted me that trash game pass. Everyone else that I've gifted game passes to has always been very grateful. So I don't know why this guy is being so ungrateful. But yeah, let me equip the first avatar this first avatar you guys might have seen if you've watched my past videos this one is basically like a reduced hitbox avatar now i'm gonna have another avatar later in the video that completely gets rid of hitboxes basically but first i want to show you guys how the reduced hitbox one works oh wait mcdonald's cheeseburger just walked up to me and started punching me i can't even reset and equip the avatar now let me just kill him really quick bro and the last update they added like a cooldown for when you can reset and you have to wait like 20 seconds within someone punching you or something crazy like that it's actually kind Kinda annoying so let me just kill this bozo very quickly and then i'm gonna reset and show you guys how this avatar works because it is very cool yoink let me hit you with explosive shuriken el bozo you were already below half health and of course i'm gonna do flash strike and whirlwind kick on you oh and that killed him that fast okay you guys already know we're gonna emote on him as well this is like my new favorite emote bro i love it so much yo let's pick up a trash can and throw it at him as well there he is over there fighting the weakest dummy yo <laughs> bro tried to dodge it and just got flung across the map and he said what i was out of the way nah this dude is mad okay i'm gonna reset though now and use the new avatar and yes sir this is our reduced hitbox avatar now i'm gonna show you guys the other avatar later in a few minutes that completely gets rid of hitboxes it is so overpowered i can't wait to test it out what is that avatar it's so ugly lol okay i know that you're not the one calling me ugly your normal avatar in merch already sucks but this this is such a new low for you, lol. Ha ha ha. Okay, I know he's not dissing my merch. We just dropped new merch the other day. Matter of fact, I'm gonna shout out everyone who's bought the merch today. Thank you guys so much to everyone who's been buying like all of the shirts and UGC items. I really, really appreciate it. But without further ado, let me just fight this bozo. We switched to Metal Bat and I am ready to destroy him. I'm just gonna hit him with home run. Yes, sir. He's probably gonna try to hit me in a second and not land any shots. Yeah, he's literally, bro, is 
Ash just missing his punches. I don't know what is up with him. Uh, we hit him with home run once again. And is he already at half health? That is crazy. Yeah, he missed that shot as well. Bro, no, this is actually so fun to troll with, this avatar. He has missed so many shots. Like, it actually throws people off so badly when you use this avatar in a 1v1. I love the new foul ball animation, by the way. Everyone, rate the new animations 1 through 10 in the comments. Oh, he is so low. And he's typing what in the shot? I don't know if he's even landed a single shot on me other than that one like two seconds ago okay you are dead now buddy yes sir and uh we are going to take the l on him bro and the l dance looks so goofy with this avatar <laughs> i'm not gonna do the zero hitbox avatar just yet because i have this other avatar and i did the math it is the biggest avatar you can get in the strongest battleground so i've got my normal avatar right here and then i'm gonna equip these two items the smile dog item and the huge rectangle item and then if i just reset i'm not sure how long it's gonna be before they remove these from the game but bro look at how big my avatar is <laughs> like my avatar is bigger than this bench right here like bro if i pick up a trash can oh my it's so cool i'm just gonna walk up to him and get his reaction of my avatar bro just said lol what kind of avatar is that you said you weren't messing around stop playing around and he's just punching me lol you're so much easier to hit yeah i might be a little bit easier to hit but um this avatar still throws a lot of people off like you can see like my avatar just spins around but uh we're still gonna beat him in this 1v1 i don't think this avatar actually like affects the hitboxes and makes them worse if anything it might make it more difficult for people to hit you but um yeah i just flung him across the map with home run and now now i'm gonna hit you with grand slam buddy yes sir like what are you even doing bro you are so trash you're down to half health yo watch this i'm gonna hit him with this trash can yoink yo i'm gonna hit him with two trash cans in a row oh you wanna hit me with that one buddy well i just dodged it Yo, we hit him with two trash cans in a row and now we're gonna do home run as well he just types in the shot how i jumped over it bro are you even able to like jump over trash cans what i, I don't know what bro is on about but um yeah you were literally below half health are we just knocking him the second he gets back up okay i'm gonna hit him with grand slam now and he's actually so low like how is he this low right now oh you canceled out one of my moves yo congratulations bro but uh i'm gonna hit you with foul ball now and end your whole career you're dead and i wonder what emotes would look like with this avatar like if i do the bouncy emote <laughs> Bro, this looks so goofy. Okay, I'm gonna walk back up to him. And then in a second, guys, I'm gonna show you like the zero hitbox avatar. Oh, McDonald's cheeseburger just walked up to me and said, bro, that avatar is so unfair. I do not see at all how this avatar is unfair. And he is now screaming in the chat. Okay, I'm, I'm trying to switch to my other avatar. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna let him kill me so that once he kills me, I'm gonna have this zero hitbox avatar when I respawn. So basically what you wanna do to get this avatar is you kind of wanna like combine the past two avatars i'll show you so we're gonna equip the small avatar and then we're gonna equip these like really big items and what this does is it pretty much makes it impossible for them to hit you because these accessories if he walks up to me and like punches the side of me right here it's not actually gonna register as a hit because he hit like my hat and these accessories are like five times bigger than my actual avatar so him trying to 1v1 me is basically him trying to 1v5 me and it's gonna be almost impossible for him to hit any of his shots you guys will see here he is right here and i'm just gonna stand still and yeah he just tried to hit me but he didn't hit any of his shots yoink bob bam pow bro it is gonna be pretty much impossible for him to kill me i'm gonna do grand slam on him and we're also gonna do foul ball oh and we got ultimate okay bet okay let me activate this yes sir yeah we're gonna do savage tornado on him and then we're also gonna do brutal beatdown which i don't really remember how to do i i've still been really confused with how to do this ever since they first released it but i think we're doing an okay job this dude is getting destroyed actually you know what before i kill him i i doubt he's gonna be able to hit me at all so i'm gonna give down a game pass to a random person in the comments from my last video here's someone that commented the secret word in my last video and they want metal bat all right i got you let me go ahead and send this guy early access and then i'll say the secret word you guys gotta comment here in a second if you want me to give you a game pass in the next video but uh where did mcdonald's cheeseburger go oh he's hiding 
hiding in a corner right here. Bro, thought that I wouldn't find him. You know what? Let me hit him with a trash can. Yoink! And we are going to do beat down as well. Nah, bro is actually getting destroyed. Yes, sir. Oh, wait. I'm gonna hit him with foul ball. Yoink! Oh, my. How is that on his? Bro, this game is actually like so broken. I tried to hit him with that move and then just landed on top of him. But yeah. Oh, we didn't kill him yet. Okay, he's one shot. We just walk up to him and. Oh, my gosh. I hate this game. He said, lol. Yeah, you're not gonna be the one laughing here in a second, buddy. You're dead. Um, and the secret word for the game pass is koala. Yeah, because that's like a funny word. Uh, all right. See you guys. Today in the strongest battlegrounds, I kind of figured out how to use Gojo in a public server and we trolled a bunch of people. I also trolled my brother Daiwei with this moveset and I trolled Ana, like my girlfriend. And then, bro, Daiwei ended up like stealing Ana. I, it is crazy. Just watch the full video to see what happens. And also stick around until the end if you guys want a chance to win some game passes. Uh, also, please join my Roblox group and buy my merch. Okay, yeah, let, let's get into the video now. So the strongest battlegrounds completely revamped gojo and today what we're gonna be doing is we are gonna be using the brand new gojo moveset in a public server kind of you guys will see how i'm gonna do it but first i want to show off this like brand new moveset all this stuff they've added so all three of these moves right here have been revamped of course we have infinity which is what you need to do to activate gojo and then the red move was changed and renamed to repulse this is what red looks like now yoink el bozo el weakest w yo why is the weakest dummy crying now okay well we're we're gonna be using the purple move on him now the purple move was changed to a race and the weakest dummy you're gonna be crying harder in a second whenever i use this move on you they completely revamped gojo the gojo balls look different now and bro look at dude that move is so sick but the move that is by far the coolest is this new move right here called attract now they ended up replacing the blue move with this and let me just show you guys how attract works it is so cool so there's this blue ball that the weakest dummy is in and wherever i move my mouse he goes and and now the weakest dummy disappeared. But you're able to use this on like five people at once. So let me just spawn in like a bunch of weakest dummies. I forgot that the weakest dummies can emo now. But uh, now we are going to do this on them. And just watch, bro. We are literally moving around five weakest dummies at once. Bro, this is going to be so fun to troll with in a public server. Like I already know we are going to make the entire server rage quit when I do this move on them. But if I'm going to be trolling as Gojo, I need to get some drip. So that's why I'm going to be dressing up as Gojo really quickly. In order to get people's genuine reactions, I'm not going to be doing this on my main account. I'm going to do it on an alt account so that nobody knows it's me. It's like, if everyone knows that it's me on the account, they're just going to like assume that I'm recording and they're probably going to be like, oh my gosh, Mango Pool, please give me Gojo. I am going to be giving out Private Servers Plus though in this video. If you guys want a chance to win Private Servers Plus, all you got to do is comment the secret word when I say it, as well as your username and what game pass you want. I'm not sure what I should call this account though. Is the real Gojo taken? Yeah, yep, that username is taken. Okay, I'm gonna call this account Gojo is Pro XD, and then uh, let me just go ahead and like put a random password as well. And now let's sign up. Look at this little bacon account. Look at this bozo right here. Look at this noob. Yo, look at him. L Bacon, L Bozo. Yeah, this is what we're gonna be dressing up as. So we just have to like replicate this. Should be pretty easy. I think the first thing we're gonna look for is some hair. So let me just go over to the Roblox catalog, and I guess we'll just search up like white spiky hair. I I'm not sure what to search. Up. Actually, someone might have just uploaded a Gojo hair. Um, oh, this person uploaded his mask and his hair. Okay, let's go ahead and buy this. Oh my gosh, I have to freaking like buy Robux for this. They literally changed the Robux prices again to make it more expensive. I am so bad. You know what? I'll just use the Floaty's star code and give him like 50 cents. I know I used Lanky Box's star code in the past two videos, so I'll use Floaty's star code now. You guys can stop being mad at me in the comments. But yeah, we got our 500 Robux, so now let's go ahead and dress up this avatar. I found this gojo hair that i think looks a lot better so i'm gonna go ahead and buy this one instead and then there's a lot of gojo faces as well honestly bro this one is looking kind of fire bro okay i'm gonna buy this let's go ahead and buy it and then i think we can also buy some gojo sunglasses oh these ones are literally just called gojo okay i'm gonna buy these yo let me know in the comments have any of you guys watched jujutsu kaisen before i've never watched it i haven't even watched that many animes like i used to watch pokemon when i was younger and then i think i watched like 15 episodes episodes of naruto and uh that's that's all of the animes that i've watched the next thing we gotta buy though is like gojo's jacket i wonder if there's any like accessories that give the jacket as well oh there are okay let me go ahead and buy this and now we're gonna look for his jacket so let's go on shirts and we'll just search up gojo and see what pops up okay there are a lot of people that have gojo's jacket uploaded this one right here looks pretty good so i'm gonna go ahead and buy that 
that. And then we're just gonna find some matching pants now. I think these look pretty good. Oh, no, these are 25 Robux. You think I am paying 25 cents for these? Yeah, the exact same one is down here for five Robux. Yeah, f*** you. I'm not spending 25 Robux. Okay, I'm gonna put this avatar together. Here is a little before. Uh, You guys are gonna have to say goodbye to the bacon. And Roblox is once again doing the thing where they don't load the avatar at all on the avatar editor page. I'm gonna have to, like, make a private server and then join it so we can see the avatar. I'm just gonna name the server Gojo is Pro and let's buy. And now let's load into the server and see what our avatar looks like. Yo, we are actually looking so drippy, bro. We look just like Gojo. Yeah, I should have, like, enough Robux on this account now to go ahead and buy private servers plus. So let me... It says send to... No, I wanna buy it. Okay, apparently I have to go on the Roblox website to buy it private servers plus. Bro, I need an extra 71 Robux. No, Roblox, I'm not giving you five more dollars. I'm gonna go on my main account and I'm gonna gift this to myself. I am not giving Roblox more money, bro. Normally, I agree with making the rich richer, but not when it comes to Roblox and this awful website. Okay, let me go ahead and like gift private servers plus to my alt account. Wait, I forgot the username of my account. Okay, Gojo is pro XD. Uh, let me just like type that in and we now have private servers plus on this account. Wait, I need to click the button first. Okay, I clicked the button. We now have private servers plus on that account uh yo what is the weakest dummy doing bro is dancing you know what i'll join the weakest dummy yes sir okay but while i'm in the server on my main account i guess i should give out some more game passes to some people from my last video here's a bunch of people from my last video who commented the secret word this first person wants early access so i can go ahead and give that to them if you guys want to win a game pass literally all that you have to do is like the video subscribe and then comment your username and what game pass you want as well as the secret word and I'm picking like a bunch of random people who do that to give the game passes to. This next person wants private servers plus, so I'm gonna give that to that. Bro, they typed the wrong username. Okay, this guy wants early access, so I'll give that to him. And yeah, yo, enjoy your early access, bro. This person wanted extra emote slots, so I can give you that as well, bro. I'm literally giving out so many game passes. Like, guys, I I'm the top G. This guy wanted me to gift him an extra emote. You know what? I'll give you three extra emotes because I'm just I'm the top G, bro. I'm so cool. Let me know what emotes you got bro if you were watching this video uh if you guys get a emote gifted from me let me know which one you get but yeah i don't want to waste too much of our time giving out game passes because people like to click off whenever i give out game passes low ass attention span but yeah before i do this in the public server thing that i'm gonna do i kind of want to troll a few people with the new gojo moveset so i think the first person we're gonna troll is daiwei and then i also really want to troll anna also for those of you who don't know anna has a channel now so make sure to subscribe to it we're gonna be posting some videos on there pretty soon but yeah let me just switch to gojo and i think we're gonna troll daiwei i need to like dm him i just pulled up my dms with daiwei and he's like sending me a bunch of tatsumaki gifts for some reason i don't know why he's doing that but i'm gonna just message him saying yo 101v1 for a video and let's see what he says bro this man daiwei really replied saying will you help me fight the e-girl after we record why is daiwei so desperate i'm just gonna reply back saying sure and i have a really good idea bro i'm gonna gonna troll Daiwei as an e-girl version of Gojo later. It'll probably be in like a separate video. And Daiwei said, okay bet, let's go Bubba those. Gonna destroy you in this 1v1 and get an e-girl. Yeah, Daiwei, I don't think you're gonna be destroying me, buddy. Let me just go ahead and get this private server link though so I can send it to Daiwei. Uh, okay, there. I'm gonna DM this to him. And now, we just need to patiently wait for Daiwei to load in. It's probably gonna take him like five years to load in because his internet is trash. Like, I live in the same house as Daiwei. He's my brother, but but I just have better internet than him. Uh, El Bozo, El Daiwei. Oh, guys, Daiwei has arrived. He said, can we get this 1v1 over with so I can look for e-girls? And I just replied with, yeah, Daiwei, sure. Let me switch movesets first, though, and then I'm gonna go ahead and use the brand new Blade Master moveset. Oh, I forgot. I don't have early access. Okay, luckily, I have some Robux on this account still, so I'm gonna buy that, and we're gonna switch to Blade Master, and then we're just gonna do one match with this moveset, and then right afterwards, we're gonna use Gojo, and it is gonna be so funny, bro. Daiwei Daiwei will be so bad. Okay, here he is right here. I'm just gonna do a countdown. Three, two, one, go. And I'm just gonna start immediately attacking Daiwei. Boink, bop, bam, pow. Yes, sir. You are trash, Daiwei. You have not even been able to get a single hit on me because I'm the top G. Oh, he just asked why I'm dressed up as Gojo. Um, it's my Halloween costume. Okay, let me go back to hitting him. If you troll me with Gojo, I'm gonna report you. Oh, Daiwei, I'm so scared of you reporting my Roblox account, Daiwei. It's not like Roblox actually reads a single report bro but uh let me just finish off daiwei boink bop bam pow you are trash daiwei you are literal dog water you just got killed by the top g now i'm gonna claim my one for 
free emote and then i'm just gonna emote on you let's see hopefully we got a good emote oh we got the backflip emote yes sir i'm about to do a backflip on daiwei elbozo and the uh, daiwei is walking up to me oh no i i can't wait to see what daiwei is gonna say did you seriously just emote on me you're using that new pay to win move set you are trash and you will never hit 300k okay first off bro daiwei said in every single video of mine that he was in that i would never hit 200k and we just hit 200k we are going to be at 300,000 subscribers in no time bro this is going to be easy and then also for whatever reason this man is called like atomic samurai pay to win bro it has two moves and no ultimate atomic samurai is the least pay to win bro atomic samurai is pay to lose i have no idea what daiwei is even talking about but uh it is time to switch to sorcerer and we are gonna destroy him just to make daiwei rage even more i'm not gonna pop infinity yet i'm just gonna let him get a bunch of free hits on me i'll let him get me down to one shot and then we're gonna activate infinity and we're just gonna troll him bro it is gonna be so funny i just said in the chat three two one go and uh daiwei immediately started attacking me yo he is actually yo is daiwei daiwei might be able to combo me oh he hit me with he hit me with grand slam and he hit me with Felbo right afterwards okay daiwei is popping off bro no 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 no. who let daiwei cook okay whenever i'm not like hitting him and comboing him and stuff he's actually okay at the game i'm just letting him get me pretty low i think probably okay no 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 he just did beat down i'm definitely one shot after this okay i need to like get up and dash away bro daiwei is running at me oh okay let me just activate infinity and then guys watch what happens whenever daiwei walks up to me bro he's trying to swing his metal bat nah you're not gonna be getting any hits on me buddy he said why can't i land any of my hits bro has never seen gojo in his entire life okay uh i'm just gonna get some punches on daiwei dude the punch animation on this gojo moveset looks so sick and uh now we're just gonna do repulse on him goodbye buddy let's just do another backflip on him too yeah mm -hmm. yeah el bozo i've said el bozo so many times in this video i need to chill but guys i'm not done trolling daiwei yet i still got two new moves to do on him and make him rage he said bro idk what you're even using but stop right now before i report you oh no daiwei's gonna report me oh no shimmer me timbers please don't report me daiwei please i'm so scared yeah don't mess with me i'm the top g daiwei did you seriously just call yourself the top g okay nah i'm gonna be doing the erase move on you bro the new gojo balls are so sick let me know in the comments do you guys like the new erase move or the old one better i know whenever i use this fourth move right here attract I, dude he's gonna rage even more just let's wait for him to walk back up oh daiwei's back yo let's see what he's gonna say this time bangle pool i'm being serious there are real consequences to your actions if you keep this up i'm gonna report you and i'm gonna do something much worse oh what what, what is daiwei gonna do that's worse than reporting my roblox account oh no uh what, what are you gonna do daiwei i'm gonna steal on oh no daiwei you're gonna steal my girlfriend okay realistically daiwei does not have a chance with on <laughs> i don't think any girl wants to date someone who looks like this daiwei is such a threat guys like make sure to watch out he might steal your girl anna is in my dms right now yeah i checked my mutual friends with daiwei and he literally doesn't even have her addy <laughs> you know what I i'm just gonna finish off daiwei with this move right here attract bro i'm like flinging him around the map yo you can pick up trees as well uh l daiwei you're dead let me just activate kick on death and before daiwei even gets another chance to rage in the chat uh we're just gonna do this move on him as well dude i love the animation on this bro this move is literally a cinematic masterpiece uh daiwei is dead and uh he got kicked from the server <laughs> Bro, Daiwei just messaged me again saying, F you, Mango Pool. You're still helping me find that e girl. Okay, let me just like close Discord and we're gonna troll Ana now. Bro, I wasn't Googling pictures of Pokemon. I was not even Googling. Okay, the next person I'm gonna be trolling is Ana. Uh, here she is right here. Wait, hold up. Let me, let me switch my movesets real quick so she doesn't get suspicious if she walks near me. But yeah, we're gonna do the same thing we did with Daiwei. We're gonna like do one match with her and then we're gonna pull out Gojo. Also, guys, Ana's bike broke. Like, I'm not even joking. Her dog tried to eat eat her microphone so we're gonna have to wait a few days for anna to start talking in the videos again but yeah i'm, I'm just gonna start hitting anna yes sir i am so good at the game i am such a professional player bonk bam bonk pow anna you are literally down to half health oh oh she got a hit on me okay okay good and she countered me bro anna is at 100 kills right now she is actually like kind of getting good at the game <laughs> i think anna might pass me in kills guys i'm not even gonna lie if anna passes me in kills that's gonna be embarrassing i'm gonna have to like actually start grinding kills bro anna is 
so low. Let me just pick up this trash can and throw it at her. Oh, no, no, no. You want to pick up a trash can and throw it at me? Well, I just dodged it. I did not even... I literally dodged that on accident. Yoink. And then, can we just finish her off with this bonk? And the uh, Anna, you're dead. Let me just, once again, use my backflip emote, L. And she just said a sad face. Wait, bro, I kind of feel bad. Um, Anna, I'm sorry for killing you. I won't do it again. Okay, as long as you don't do it again, you're fine. Uh, uh yeah, I'm gonna be switching to Gojo right now, Anna. I'll just get a few normal hits on her bonk bam pow and now i am activating ultimate yoink bro she died like immediately okay now let me just run over to where she respawned that and we are going to be doing a race on her way what did she type in the chat she just said bro anna i'm gonna be doing a race now i feel bad bro like die way it's actually fun to troll because he's really dumb but anna hasn't really done anything actually no she's done multiple videos where she has trolled me i don't even i don't even care anymore she literally pretended to date floaty zone just to troll me um anna i am now gonna be using the brand new attract move on you uh yeah goodbye anna dude this move is so cool <laughs> She said, what, bro? She is actually so mad. <laughs> okay, Anna just walked back up to me and she's standing still. I think she's having something. Oh, she said, Daiwei messaged me. He really wants to go out on a date. Bro, what? If you kill me one more time, I'm going to. Bro, Anna, please don't go on a date with Daiwei. I will let you get so many kills on me. You know what? I I'm going to unactivate Infinity and Anna, you, you can just get a free kill on me right here, right now. Okay, okay, Anna. <laughs> she just doesn't type anything in the chat. She just starts immediately punching me. Okay, after this, guys, I'm going to show you like how I'm going to be using Go in a public server kind of bro anna really picked up a trash can she really picked up a trash can yeah i told her to just counter people and throw trash cans at them and now she has 116 kills she just killed me that's 117 kills bro she's emoting on me too okay no no no. i am leaving the server i am out bro oh my gosh i wasn't even googling more pictures of pokemon okay now what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna turn this private server that i am in into a public server the first thing i'm gonna do is go to my roblox group yo before i do anything else huge shout out to everyone who is bought the merch uh th thank you guys so much for buying this i really appreciate it but i'm gonna leak this private server link to over seventy thousand people and i'm just gonna say that i'm 1v1ing fans for a video and since i'm not in here on my main account nobody is gonna suspect that this gojo account right here is me so i'm gonna go look at pictures of pokemon real quick and i'll see you guys once the server fills up guys we're pausing the video real quick because it's secret word time if you guys made it this far then comment stud likes tatsubaki and uh yeah uh, with that being said let's get back into the video oh and it looks like people are starting to load in you know what i'm gonna use gojo on both of these people right here uh yeah see this guy he is number 71 class uh you are gonna get a race with gojo real quick el bozo we killed this guy too <laughs> now i i'm just gonna use a tract on all of the people here uh yoink Yo, you guys are all dead. Yep, goodbye. This Battlegrounds game added a Zoro moveset, and I saw this as the perfect trolling opportunity. Basically, I was doing some normal 1v1s with my little brother, Daiwei. And Daiwei recently started dating this girl who likes to cosplay as Perona. But Daiwei thought she was cheating on him, so I dressed up as Zoro and tried to get with his girlfriend. And bro, she sent us a voice reveal, a face reveal. She even revealed some of Daiwei's biggest secrets. Like, watch it till the end, because this is genuinely probably my crazy easiest video i've ever made and also stick around until the end if you want a chance to win some game passes all right guys i'm about to destroy Daiwei in the strongest battlegrounds yeah you just got flung across the map now i'm gonna hit you with grand slip bro where did Daiwei even go oh my he really just appeared behind me no no no, no. you are going down bro you are not going to beat me in this 1v1 yeah let me hit him with foul ball and then we are going to hit him with grand slam once again guys i am the combo master when it comes to metal bat i'm one of the best metal bat players in the entire game bro is somehow already below half health now let me just dash out and hit you with foul ball bunk and then we're just gonna finish him off with grand slam you are dead yeah let me just go ahead and emote on him but guys i heard daiwei has a new roblox girlfriend so i think i'm gonna ask him about her real quick i'm in a call with daiwei but his voice is really annoying so i made him turn off his microphone but yeah daiwei i heard you have a new girlfriend bro is that true and daiwei said yeah she's better than anna i don't think there's any girls who are better than anna but we'll see about that but I need your help with something, though. All right, Daiwei, what do you need help with? I mean, I guess I got you. I think she might be cheating. Oh, <laughs> um, yeah, Daiwei, quite a few of your Roblox girlfriends have cheated on you. So, can you do a loyalty test on her? Uh, I guess I can. Wait, Daiwei, send me her profile really quickly. Okay, I just sent it in DMs. Bro, I pulled up her profile. She's dressed up as Perona from One Piece. I think that's how her name is pronounced. But if you guys don't know, a lot of people ship Perona and Zoro. Like, bro, there is an 
entire wiki like dedicated to shipping them for some reason so i'm gonna dress up as zoro and see if she will cheat on daiwei but i want to get some revenge on daiwei so not only are we gonna see if she's gonna cheat we're gonna try and get her to reveal one of daiwei's biggest secrets because daiwei's been hiding something and it's pretty crazy what he's been hiding and we're also gonna see if she'll do a face reveal and a voice reveal like we're gonna try and get in a call with her oh and also if you guys want a chance to win a game pass keep watching this full video because we are doing a massive giveaway but in order to have a chance to win the game pass you have to call it the secret word and be subscribed to the channel and so but yeah let's leave the game and dress up as zoro really quickly i wasn't googling pokemon editor please cut this out of the video yeah i just need to make an alt account real quick let's be born on may 22nd 1981 bro of course zoro the e-boy is inappropriate for roblox oh my also there is a brand new game that's just like the strongest battlegrounds but it has a zoro moveset and they just added a zoro ultimate so yeah we're gonna try and get her to beat us in that game okay every single user if i tried to make was taken but i got this one a zoro roblox real now let me just type out a password and let's sign up i spent so much time making this stupid bacon hair account you guys better like and subscribe but yeah let me buy some robux real quick so we can actually dress up as zoro you know what i'm using blanky box's star code because that always makes people mad and it's kind of funny bro i just spent like five dollars on robux i've been spending so much money on these videos guys please like and subscribe <laughs> but yeah let's dress up as zoro now we just gotta find some zoro items and this should be pretty simple i forget what zoro even looks like actually oh, okay here's a picture that i found bro zoro has like so many abs just like me in real life okay i guess the first thing we're gonna buy is some hair so let me go over to hair and then just search up zoro and we'll see what pops up and bro why there are so many zoro hairs i'm just gonna add the cheapest one right here to my cart and then we also gotta get a zoro face so oh my there are so many zoro faces that all look the exact same like bro these two right here are identical <laughs> all right this one right here is probably the cheapest one we're gonna find so i'm gonna add that to my cart bro i'm gonna try to find like a zoro abs shirt that's gonna look so funny oh here's one right here i tried to upload an abs shirt like this to roblox but it got content deleted and then i got a wording on my account i don't know why roblox doesn't want me uploading an abs shirt but oh wait, this one right here is actually a lot better okay i'm gonna add that to my cart now we need some matching pants i'm pretty sure this one right here matches pretty well with whatever i just bought so i'm gonna add this to the cart as well and now the last thing we need is just like a jacket right here but i don't think the game that we're gonna join supports 3d clothing so I, I guess we're just gonna have to do with what we have let me buy all of the items real quick and let's put the avatar together and bro this avatar is looking so drippy let me load into the game and show you guys our drip bro this random guy is attacking me for some reason but we are looking just like zoro oh my gosh i need to turn on reduced camera shape but yeah it is time to test daiwei's girlfriend so i'm gonna send her a friend request and we'll see how long it takes for her to accept it five minutes later okay guys i left the room for like five minutes but now i'm back let me show bro she accepted what there's no way bro there's no way she just texted me saying omg hi zoro wanna play c's battlegrounds there's no way she already asked me if i want to play that okay this is actually crazy bro i'm gonna reply with a sure i need to do something but i'll join you in 20 minutes okay guys we have 20 minutes to prepare for the loyalty test so really quickly let me just create a private server on the game that has the zoro moveset it's c's battlegrounds and we're just gonna load in really quickly so i just loaded into the game and if you go over to characters here is the zoro character right here it literally has like the swords built in i'm pretty sure you need early access but you guys already know i'm gonna be giving out game passes in this game and the strongest battlegrounds you just gotta keep watching until the end yeah i got this notepad right here and for the loyalty test i need to write down some questions that we're gonna ask her ahead of time i still have like 20 minutes so yeah we have a little bit of time before she uh joins our game so one of the questions that we have to ask her is what is daiwei's biggest secret bro daiwei has some crazy stuff that he's done before like daiwei would probably get canceled if some people found this out we also need to ask her if she would cheat on daiwei because half of daiwei's girlfriends have just cheated on him i kind of feel bad bro daiwei deserves better guy <laughs> oh wait i'm kind of dumb one question we have to ask her before this is we need to ask her if she even has a boyfriend because it would be kind of funny if she just tries to hide daiwei and she pretends that she's not dating him that would be kind of funny after we ask her if she would cheat on daiwei we also need to ask her if she has cheated on any guys in the past because if she has cheated on other guys in the past that would make her very likely to cheat on daiwei too uh, we also need to ask her if she has anything to do
do with the time Daiwei was making weird noises the other night. I'm not gonna explain what happened in the video, but it, it's probably pretty self-explanatory. Like, I think Daiwei was doing some weird stuff over Discord. I will never understand why people do this stuff over Discord. Like, bro, doing it on Discord is crazy. At least you can't contract any diseases when you're doing it over Discord, but that, that is still a wild thing to do. And then once we get the loyalty test out of the way, we're gonna ask her if she wants to call. And then once we are in the call with her, we're gonna ask her if she will do a face reveal because Daiwei doesn't even know what she looks like. I don't know why he would date a girl not knowing what she looks like. So if we can get her to do a face reveal to us before she does one to Daiwei, that will be wild. And then I'm going to ask her to be my girlfriend and we're gonna see if she will just cheat on Daiwei because bro, that would be so funny if she just cheats on Daiwei. But yeah, I'm pretty sure I spent like 20 minutes coming up with all that. So she's probably gonna be in the server here pretty soon. So I will see you guys once she's here. A few minutes later. Okay, guys, it's been a couple minutes, but she just loaded into the server. Here she is right here. Wow, your avatar is even hotter in game. Bro, these Roblox online daters are so weird. No, nah, I'm gonna screenshot all of this stuff so that we can send it to Daiwei later because I really want to see Daiwei's reaction. Okay, I'm just gonna type in the chat. Thanks. And then like a little winky face. Now, when you're doing a loyalty test, you don't want to start it right away. So I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a quick little 1v1 since I do want to test out this moveset and its ultimate. They just added the ultimate and I heard it's really cool. So I just asked her if she wants to 1v1 and she said, of course I want to 1v1. Also, your swords are so huge. Hey, yo, bro, that is size. Okay, let me just destroy her in this 1v1. Boink, bonk, bam, pow. And bro, the M1s on this are sick. Bro, there's also a little combo thing that pops up on the screen like every time you land a shot on them in a row. So we've hit her like seven times in a row. All right, let me try this first move on her it's called like a ring diggy and bro that move was sick the dash on here is cool too and bro these normal moves might look cool but the ultimate is probably gonna be 50 times cooler you know what i feel like generous so i'll let her get some hits on me um yeah just okay bro is that like off-brand consumptive punches <laughs> okay this moveset is actually sick now i'm gonna hit her with lion song and bro Oh, that was cool. Okay, now let's do Proud Phoenix. And oh, dude, Proud Phoenix is sick as well. Okay, our ultimate bar isn't too high up. It's only 24%. She just missed that shot so badly. But yeah, I'm really excited to try and get ultimate. Let me just dash away and she still hit me with that. Okay, I'm going to hit her with the final move right here. Bonk. Okay, why is it not working? Oh, wait, I was pressing five on my keyboard. That's why. I don't know why I was even pressing five, but yeah, let's just keep hitting her. Bonk, bam, bonk, pow. And bro, she's actually so low. Okay, let's hit her with this move. And did she really just cancel out that move? You know what, guys? It's fine. They don't call me the top G for nothing. I am still gonna win. Bonk. You're dead. That finisher animation was so cool. Okay, our ultimate is 36% done. So I think I probably just need to kill her a couple more times and hit her with these normal moves. Bro, does she really have a force field around here? Okay, that force field is gone. Bonk and boink. Yeah, you think you can beat the top G? That is not going to happen. But bro, guys, I'm so excited to do this loyalty test. I kind of want to just attack her a little bit because she's going to think that I'm a very strong player. And then I also really want to test out these ultimate moves. But yeah, just keep watching because we are literally going to do the loyalty test in a second but why is she just standing still she needs to fight back she just said wow you are so good at this game yo i bet she's ever said that to die way before bunk bam there is literally no one else who is as good at C's battlegrounds as i am bro i'm the best player in this entire game bro this game just released i'm already at the top of the leaderboard bro i feel like this girl is the type of person who just watches anime all day and vapes in the school bathroom like one time when i was at school there was this anime nerd girl who just kept trying to get me to hit her vape i don't know why but you know like i'm very responsible guys i would never vape or do any of that you know what i'm saying i've never done that before mm -hmm. and bro one more shot and yo friends she's to awaken we got the ultimate okay let me just activate this bro oh my gosh that animation is sick that looks so cool okay i gotta try out all of these moves on her bro bonk oh Dude, that looks so cool, and it just one-shot her. She just said, whoa, that looks so cool. I know it does. Our swords have some, like, glowy animation on them. Okay, now let's hit her with Lion Song and Proud Phoenix. And, bro, I bet this fourth move, uh, what does the fourth move do? Okay, I don't even know what that does, but I am just going to keep hitting her with my sword. And then right after this, we're gonna do the loyalty test on her. Bonk! Oh my gosh, dude, the ultimate for this is so cool, bro. That looks sick. Okay, bro, I need to kill her really quickly with my ultimate swords. 
Bon oh, dude! Did you guys just see that animation? That was sick. Okay, uh, you're dead. I just had a 27 combo on her. But guys, I think now that we've showcased this moveset, it is time to do this loyalty test on her. So yeah, you guys know the drill. I'm gonna say, hey, Perona, can I ask you some questions? And she said, sure, you can ask me anything. Okay, the first thing I'm gonna ask her is if she has a boyfriend. Um, it's a bit complicated. What does she mean by that? That should be a yes or no question. I'm with this guy named Daiwei, but I don't really like him. I only talk to him because he's a famous Roblox YouTuber. Bro, calling Daiwei a famous YouTuber is crazy. Okay, so really quickly, I'm just gonna screenshot what she just said in the chat. But yeah, now that we know she's just with Daiwei for the clout or whatever, we're gonna ask her some other questions. So I'm gonna ask her, what is Daiwei's biggest secret? Daiwei has a few really big secrets. Um, wait, I just asked her like what? So you know Daiwei's brother Mango Pool? Yeah, that is me, but I, I can't type in the chat that it's me, so I'm just gonna say yes. Mango Fool has a large collection of Tatsuwaki body pillows. How does this have anything to do with me? But Daiwei has an even bigger collection? Wait, what? He has pillows of almost every anime girl, and he has a Pokemane one? Bro, guys, I might have to sneak into Daiwei's room and steal the Pokemane pillow. That's probably what all of those strange packages at the house were. Oh, but I was, like, so confused because Daiwei kept ordering a bunch of random things for, like, a month straight. Okay, nah, that is crazy, bro. That is crazy. Okay, I guess the next question we are gonna ask her is if she would cheat on Daiwei. So I just asked her, would you cheat on Daiwei? And let's see what she says, guys. Daiwei has been cheated on so many times. I kind of feel bad for Daiwei at this point. Almost every girl who he gets with cheats on him. And she just said, oh, dude, this is really bad. She should just say no. Why is she saying, um, why is she thinking? I think I already have. What do you mean you think? Okay, I just asked her in the chat what she means by that because like how do you think you cheated on someone you should know 100% if you have or not so the other night bro all of her messages are getting tagged I tried a special plan it starts with a W oh no nah, bro I know where this is going bro this is a crazy story bro what is she even saying and then I got in a call with this person and did some very sus stuff what do you mean by very sus stuff I just asked her in the chat dude this girl is so weird. I don't think I can say it on Roblox. Okay, then. Okay, I'm gonna ask her if the plant influenced her to do this because if it did, then I guess she didn't cheat intentionally. No, I would have done it either way. The plant just made it more fun. Okay, so she did cheat on Daiwei then. What does she mean? She doesn't know if she did or not. She literally cheated on Daiwei with some random Discord person. Yo, this is the guy right here who Daiwei's girlfriend cheated on him with. I guess this guy has more Riz than Daiwei. Let me know in the comments who do you guys think has more Riz, the Discord mod or Daiwei? I think the Discord mod has more Riz. That's just my opinion though. Okay, I think I've asked her all of the questions I want to ask, so now it's time to hop in a Discord call with her. Actually, no, no, no. I have one more question. I want to ask her how many guys she's dated in the past because, in my opinion, I feel like the more guys who a girl has been with, the easier it is going to be to pull her because if a girl has been with like 50 different guys, you're probably not going to have to try that hard to get with her but if she's only been with like one guy then yeah it's probably gonna be like kind of difficult to like pull her so this is really gonna put Daiwei's Riz to the test I'm gonna ask her how many guys have you been with and she said a lot I kind of lost count okay that is wild bro how does she lose count of how many guys she's been with <laughs> why I think I've dated 45 people in the past three years okay let me pull out the calculator real quick there's 1095 days in three years so if we divide that by 45 that means that every 24 days she gets a new boyfriend if any of you guys want to get with her it's probably not going to be too hard just wait 24 days yeah guys i think that means Daiwei doesn't have the best riz but we've been in a server with her for 43 minutes so i think it's time to try and get in a call with her i'm just gonna ask her do you want a voice chat and let's see what she says and she said sure okay okay here's what i'm gonna do i have an alt account on discord because if i add her on my mango pool discord account that seems a horrible idea she's gonna notice right away that it's me so i told her to add me and bro i just got a friend request from someone named perona what the frick okay let me accept this okay i just sent her like a wave thing
Gaming, and let's see what she says. Okay, I'm gonna call her on Discord and let's see if she joins. And yo, she just loaded it. Okay, I think I'm gonna have to talk in like a British accent because I don't know if she's gonna recognize my voice or not. A lot of people have said I sound like Daiwei if he had a deeper voice. <laughs> so, okay, guys, I'm gonna unmute in three, two, one. Yo, Proto, what's up? Yo, do you guys like my British voice? You know, I think I have a pretty good British voice. And bro, why is she not unmuting? I'm gonna type in this chat, Perona unmute. And let's see what she says. And bro, she just said, I'm nervous. Okay, I asked her if she'll unmute if I can beat her in a fight. And she said, okay, I will. Perfect. Also, don't ask why I'm recording this at 2.29 a.m. I've been working like 12 hours a day on my new Roblox game. Okay, like I've barely had time to record. That's why I've only been uploading once every like two days. But yeah, I guess I just need to beat her in a fight real quick bro she probably is not gonna be able to beat me because i'm the top g i'm the best player at this game boy bonk bam pow like prona i'm just gonna be honest i think you're a little bit trash at the game i don't think you're that good bonk yo let me know in the comments who you guys think is better me or prona bonk and you are dead yo prona that was the easiest fight ever i don't know how you even lost she just said that was hard Wait, what okay i just asked her if she can unmute now and she said i'm really nervous i'll just send a voice recording and said uh, bruh okay what do you want me to say in the voice recording so i told her to say i love zoro so much more than Daiwei. she said okay i'll send it right now okay perfect and bro she just sent an audio that says voice reveal okay let's listen to this three two one I love Zora so much more than Dai Wei. Bro, there's no way this is like an actual e-girl. What the? Okay, wait, wait. Let's try to get her to do a face reveal now. Okay. I just asked her, can you do a face reveal? And she said, okay. And then, bro, it's like a spoiler. Okay, bro, no way. This is the girl who just cheated on Dai Wei. Bro, this is crazy. I am out. Oh, also, if you guys made it this far, just comment a random word for the secret word. Let's confuse everyone who didn't watch it till the end and tries to cheat.